Hey, howdy, and how's it going, everybody? We're back here with Fears to Fathom, episode 2. That means two in Italian. Looks like we actually have graphic settings this time, which is pretty huge. Wait, I have V-Sync on, but I felt like it's hard to tell if I need V-Sync because I'm definitely getting screen tear, but that's probably just the VHS effect they're putting on it. Still no sound settings though, which is actually, now that I realize, is what I actually wanted last time. This one is apparently 40 minutes, so this one's gonna be a little bit longer. And then I don't know how long the last one is, but I know this one's gonna be longer, so let's hop into it. Norwood Hitchhike. Ooh, that means I'm gonna be outside. This happened to me when I was 19. I'm a little over 21 now. I still remember this very clearly because of how creeped out I felt. I was a bit hesitant to write this out for the internet at first, but getting it out may help, even if just a little bit. I was one of those people that loves gaming conventions. <gasps> I'd go to every convention I get the chance to. <gasps> I don't do quite that. And sometimes even meet some of my online friends. That's kind of the whole point, right? Though my parents weren't always thrilled at the idea of me going on an interstate drive. Damn, you drove there? You wild. But a plane ticket would have been too expensive. This convention I was at went, went great. And then, uh, wait, hold on. I forgot how to read this time. This convention I was at went great. And it was now the day to drive back home. But when I set off, I soon realized the traffic was horrible. I decided that I'd take the long way to avoid the traffic. It was a little over 12 hour drive. Oh, I get to actually drive. Let's go. I'm breaking the law. I'm drunk as shit right now, brother. Escape to read message. I'm driving, dude. Hold on. You gotta do what you gotta do. Yeah. Okay. I mean, yeah, you're right. I don't really, I don't really want that song. Oh. Oh, I'm in my lane. Shut up, asshole. Where did you reach? Still about six hours away from the city. Got stuck in a jam. Oh! Got stuck in a jam. I wonder what type of jam it was. Probably strawberry or grape, I feel. What? I'm out of gas? If I go in reverse, do I get the gas back? We gotta make it as far as we can. I knew I shouldn't have had the radio on. I knew that was burning my gas. I feel like I'm not going much faster. Told you to take that flight. Yeah, well, I couldn't afford it, Dad. Hold on, I'm taking a corner. What? Oh, Holly is gonna be late when you reach back. Hope you're feeling all right. No. My vision's kind of grainy and I'm low on gas. And I, I just, oh shit. Wait. Good parking job. I have to open, oh my God, I parked wrong, dude. I don't even know if I can reach it. Where's it even at? Is it the one that I put in like the butt? Where the hell is the gas cap at, man? I'll just go inside and ask for help, I guess. Hey, you guys know where the gas cap's located at? Hi, can I get $10 on pump two? Sure. Oh wait, that was me asking him. Dot, dot, dot. You heading to the bridge by yourself? The bridge? The Nord Valley Road, I mean. Not a lot of people had down there this time of year. Be careful. What do you mean? For about a century now, many people have been going missing down there. And people who went looking for them never returned. Locals say the Norwood Valley monster had torn them up and hung them upside down on trees. Can I use the toilet? It's not clean. Fuck. Hey. Oh, I can't talk to you. You're too good to me, huh? Yeah, well, frick you. Frick you, man. Select an item. Hmm. <gasps> Wait, how much money do I have? See, I gotta, uh, hopefully, what, I don't know what I was gonna say. Meat snack food? What? Oh yeah, it's just called meat, meat, meat. All right, it's kind of weird. Lime drink, onion rings, nuts, chocolate, more cola, energy. Consume, wait, increase your sprint speed? Wait, is there actual item use in this one? I don't know, I'm confused. I do feel a little bit faster though. Wait, I could have just got one here. We'll buy a chocolate bar too then. Just in case I get a little bit peckish. Should I just buy everything so that way I run super fast? Hey, am I faster? Does that look like I'm going faster? I'll buy one more thing. I wanted to buy something more expensive because I felt like the cheaper item I bought, the more, the less time it was worth waiting. I don't know if it's really true, but whatever. 
Should I buy another one? Okay, this is my last one, I swear. I'm just trying to really check if it does make me go faster. And if it does, then maybe it'll be worth it. But maybe I'm gonna overeat and over drink and then it's gonna be harder for me to run away. I, and one more thing. Yeah, what's that boss? If you see a woman in a white or blue gown trying to get a ride, do not stop. Just step on the gas as hard as you can. Okay, I won't ask any questions. Whatever you do, never ever, under any circumstance, pick up a hitchhiker. Those people out there on the road putting their thumbs out, they ain't what you think, ma'am. They just ain't. All right, brother, thanks for the info. What's up, ma? Uh-oh. Oh, he's going to his van. Um, I don't know if you'll find any shop at this hour, but we're out of dog food. Bitch, could you get something for Milo? Let me look. Wait, what's this? Didn't want it, wasn't feeling it. I was too low on cash for that. Okay. Can I buy this? You got pump too. Thanks. Can I? I'll just take it. I don't care. You need to pay for that, ma'am. No, I'm good. Okay, well, how? How do I pay for it? I'm willing to pay for it. Ring me up, pussy. Maybe I can glitch it through the door. Oh, cool. It worked. All right. Got some dog food. Can I open up my trunk at all? Let's go. There we go. Side mission complete. Wait, I actually have to fill it up, I bet, huh? My car was parked. God damn it. Let's, uh, dude, I, it's so bright. I cannot, like, it. I can't see where I'm at or how close I am to something. This is probably good enough. My car is, okay, yeah, it's still a little bit too far away. Okay, how about, how about now? There we go. Okay, quite picky. Just gonna say it. I filled the tank and I was off the road again. Since my mom asked to buy something a mile from the store, Oh, you had to buy something. I already got it. We're good. Bro, I already stole it. Now you want to buy it? God damn it, dude. <sighs> hey, can I buy this? Be $5? Oh my God, you're a scam artist, buddy. Well, I have way too much dog food. Now any sort of wild animal out in nature is going to smell it all and chase me down. Oh. There we go. There we go. Dude, it's so bright. I can't tell how close I am to it. All right, and here we go. On the road again. So, well, a little. Okay, now we're on the road again. Being on the road, you do realize a thing. What's that? Monsters truly do exist. Yeah, but that, that gas station clerk was nice. And every single one of them looks just like you and me. Yeah, that's kind of true. Kind of messed up though as well, to be honest. Hold on. It's not expired or anything, right? No, probably not. Uh-oh. My headlights went out. Oh, they're back. I can't see where I'm at. Oh, there's a car in front of me. Look at that. I'm not alone out here. Yippee. Oh, but my lights are flashing, so maybe they're going to pull over and I'll rob them. I'll take their car. Oh, I think theirs are flashing too. They're probably really confused. Get out of the way, asshole. Okay, I was gonna overtake him, but I literally I just can't. I don't even know how I caught up to him, really. Wait, they're so much faster than me now. What happened? Probably because I honked. Either that or my lights went out, so they thought I was gonna roll up on them and steal their car, actually, or something. Uh-oh. Is there something behind me? I can't look. I tried, but I couldn't. Jesus, dude, I'll be getting sick driving like this. I can't turn smoothly worth a shit. Need a controller for this bitch. Still just driving though. So far, it's not too bad. As long as I just never stop, I should be fine. Hopefully this bridge isn't out. I couldn't read those signs. I was too busy driving past them. Does feel like a weird place for a hitchhiker to maybe be though. I don't know where hitchhikers normally sit. Normally on the corner, I get. Well, not always. I'm thinking prostitutes, but they're sort of the same. They're both just looking for a ride. Maybe some cash. I feel like this isn't the road I'm supposed to be on. I'm gonna be honest, Holly. And like, I know I'm supposed to be you, Holly, but like, I don't know. Feels a little bit weird, especially when our lights keep going out. How shitty is your damn car, man? So far, it's just a driving sim, but uh, based on the name, like Norwood Hike, Hitchhike? Well, I guess, no, because when I read Hitchhike, I'll be honest, I thought I was just, it was a, it was a form of hiking. 
What was, there was no way, no way that's a bunny making that sound. Bunnies don't make that sound. I don't know what sound bunnies make, but I know sure as hell it's not that. They probably make like, I don't know, I want to say they cheep for some reason. I just feel like they sort of make cheeping sounds. There's this very weird thing about that night. I saw two big logs in the middle of the road blocking oh, the way ahead. Thought I could drive past the logs, but those things wouldn't budge. Nope. I thought I saw somewhere on the left side I could like pull in, but I've reversed really far and I don't see it still. Oh wait, here it is. Dude, I got some bright ass head- There's no wonder these headlights are flickering, man. Yeah, too much power running to them. Holy shit. It's almost like someone deliberately put those there. Probably. I mean, I don't think they just fell. Can't go in there, which I think I'm happy about. Oh. Bro, why that bear got goofy ass tiny little fucking legs, bro? Nah, that thing's probably gonna kill me though. Maybe I should've gotten out closer up there. Cause now I have to walk all the way up there and that just seems dumb. All right, maybe I'll just drive my car up there. I don't know. I can't look behind me, so I'm just, oh yeah, I'm definitely, I definitely turned in, yeah. You're a terrible driver. You're, look, your car does not help. Like I'm, I'm trying to turn the steering wheel. Look at how much it's moving. It's barely moving. Clearly do not have power steering. And that's obvious. Okay, we'll get out right here. Why did it feel, I mean, like I know I backed up so I was going a lot slower, but it felt like it took me so long to get there whenever I was backing up. What? But I didn't think much of it at the time. Wait, what did I say? Fuck, dude, I missed some of the text. Say it again. Say what you said again. I'm sure that was actually somewhat vital. Maybe I should get back in my car. I'm getting scared, but maybe then I'll get out again just so I can. It almost seems as someone had delivery put those there, but I didn't think, okay, so yeah, I already saw all that. Am I just walking home from here on out then? Those are heavy. Okay, I can just move them. Okay. No, where are you, what are you doing? Okay. Huh. I moved the lock, bitch. I heard something out there, bro. Okay, it's moved, fuck. I don't know what the hell that sound is. I didn't think I would just... I was gonna say, how am I moving, but my car is literally just idling or stalling right now. I didn't think I could move those. Like, mostly because they were uh, like giant fucking logs. Uh, that was my first kind of like idea that I probably wouldn't be able to move them, but like, I, I don't know, maybe they're water logs or they're a lot lighter or something. Or just like driftwood or whatever. I don't know, man. They're really light though. Cause like all my log cutters out there, I know I have a large fan base of log cutters. Like how much would something like that weigh? Like my guess would be, I mean, definitely a couple hundred pounds. Um, if I had to get more specific, I mean, I would say 200 to 300 pounds maybe easily. I mean, I'm sure it depends on the type of wood. I'm sure it depends on how it's been treated. Like as far as like, has it been in the sun for long periods? Has it been waterlogged? Maybe it's uh, something else. Maybe it's hollowed out, but you just couldn't tell because you didn't look at the right side. But like, if that was a full log, right? How much would that weigh? Be sure to let me know. Beautiful night, I guess. Can't really see much, but no hitchhikers. So that's been good. Jesus, fuck. I thought I'd just try the radio again. No, I can't change channels either. The only channels I got are on and off. Why is there pants in here? Is that pants? Is there a shift button to shift put on turbo? I, when I hit shift, I saw my speedometer go up ever so slightly, so I didn't know if it actually worked, but I don't think it did. Is my car overheating? Okay, something's bad gonna happen soon. I gotta get out of here. Yeah, my car's overheating. Oh, all right. Well, I guess I'll just get back in it. Oh, oh no. Fuck. I should have never stopped it. And just like that, I was standing in the middle of nowhere with no phone service. And hopefully we got a light. I'm not saying I was starting to believe what I... That book I got... <laughs> uh, what was he saying? I forgot. Why do I still see that? Didn't I... Wait. Wait, what, 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 what? I was scared to think how long it would take for someone to pass. Bro, I'm... Ah. Uh.
Did I die? 10.23 p.m. Someone's coming by. Maybe it's the gas station clerk coming to double check on me. Or was my hood a QR code? I saw a car nearing. Oh, yeah. Hey. Okay, see ya. You know what I'm saying? Someone could leave another human being on a straight. Bro, did you not hear what the gas station person said? They probably stopped at the same place. Plus, I mean, if it, if that road's anything like the one I drove down, they'll be back. Like, what the fuck? 10.43 p.m. Yeah, I mean, you're really not having to wait all too long. 20 minutes? It's not too bad. Wait, the logs are gone. Oh, wait, no, they're still there. Can I start my car yet? Hey, excuse me. Ugh. <sighs> Wait, he stopped. Oh, but the music got creepier. I don't like that. SE6428. Okay, I got his license plate. Ew. You're the girl from the gas station. Hi, thank you so much for stopping. Didn't think anyone... Oh, wait. Uh, I... What are you trying to do out here? I think my car just broke down. I can't call for help. You think I can get a ride? Where are you heading to? Hmm. Just the nearest stop where I can call for help. Hop in. Thanks so much. Could you wait till I get my stuff? Hurry up. Just throw it in the back. I won't be here for too long. All right. I'm going. I got to get the dog food. I'll take one suitcase and some dog food. Maybe I can cycle it. Hold on. Hold on, sir. I'll be right there. I felt like I lost one. Oh, yeah, I did. Almost ready. Why can't I put the last one? Fuck. Fuck it. I'll just leave it here in case I get robbed or something. Here, I need to get moving out. Uh, can you help me get my stuff? It's not safe to get out here. Okay. Well. Why? Why can't I... Should, do I get in the bed too? I'm confused. Why can't I get in? Do I have to get go 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 be kebaba? Why can't? Is this broken? Why can't I grab it? And why can't I get in? Whatever, it's just a hack. Can I go now? Bro, what is going on? Is this shit bugged? I'm so confused. Like, what am I? Uh, what? Uh, Right? Just run me over, I guess. The fuck? You need to hurry up. I don't have all day. Dude, trust me. I I wish I didn't eat. Like, I wish it was just working. What am I supposed to do, bro? It had to bug out. I don't want to redo all that driving dog shit. Look, it's the guy's truck. Maybe I can go ahead and put my stuff in there early. Gotta buy all my sweets again. Big mistake. Well, that guy's gonna stop for me later. Hopefully he actually lets me in his goddamn car this time. All right, here's where my car trouble start. Oh yeah, see? I can't even drive at all this time. Car wouldn't start back up. Was I not even supposed to be able to drive last time or something? Wait, I'm confused now. Well, I'm gonna think ahead this time and move my stuff there earlier. Road trap. Damn, that didn't do a thing. All right. I tried to mess him up. Maybe I thought it would get caught in their, like, their axle or something. Damn, it's extra dark out here, though. I can't see shit. Excuse me. <sighs> yep, just keep her going like this. Oh, hey. You're the girl from the gas station. What are you trying to do here? I think my car just broke down. I can't call for help. You think I can get a ride? Where are you heading to? Just up the road. Hop in. Thanks so much. Could you wait till I get my stuff? Hurry up. Just throw it in the- I, feel I started giving them the same voice. There's three. And then our last one. Four. Alright, let's roll out. Bro. Ain't no way, brother. So wait, you're telling me last time it was actually messed up just because I couldn't take my hat. There's no way, right? There's no way. For a hat? I'm pretty sure that's the reason it did. Just because, like, unless it wants me to also throw my car back there. Like, I don't know. Is there anything else? I don't think so. What? Do I not take the skateboard? I'm so confused, dude. Uh, open it. Am I am I stupid? Do I need my pants from in there or something? Oh wait, now I'm done. Finally, now hop in, be quick. Bitch, that's all. So it really was my hat because I'm pretty sure I tried that last time and just because my hat was on the ground, I couldn't do it. Howdy, partner, want a blowjob?
But I'm a woman. I don't know if I can make jokes. Of course I can. They're just not funny. <gasps> Mind if I turn the volume on? Mind if I honk your horn? So you won't tell me who you are, where you're going? Um, I was driving home and that piece of crap broke down on me. Jason. What? My name is Jason. It's nice to meet you, Jason. Pretty clean truck. I don't think you murdered many people in here. You're really lucky I had to be on this side of the town tonight. I must say, you are one brave young woman. How's that? You got any clue what happened to your car back there? Um, I think it was a battery. Are you sure? It's my dad's, it's pretty old. Probably wasn't the battery. But this guy feels like a creep. He's gonna ask me another question soon, I can just feel it. So what do you think about what he told you back at the gas station? I didn't listen to a single word. He really creeped me out. He's funny. These are all very heavily doubtings. You know, it's like, oh yeah, like that could happen. I'll just never answer and eventually we'll get there. So. Now, um, I'll say he really creeped me out. Interesting. Idiot tells that to every person traveling down here. Bro, you even said yourself it was dangerous to get out. I'm just saying. So is it true? What, the monster? Let's see, I've never seen the monster. He's the monster. But there are, there are some things. And I'm afraid your car breaking down could have been one of them. I don't want to sound like that moron, but just remember this. You don't bother them and don't, you don't be bothered. True. But well, I'm not bothering you, right? Probably not, we're probably good. You know, I'm sorry for being jerked to you before. I'm not the best with people. Okay. Yeah, that, I guess neither am I with that conversation. Could just said like, yeah, all good, man. Or, but no. Uh oh, it's going dark. He's about to be stabbing me. So a little bit of small talk. He dropped me by a motel. Oh yeah, I forgot these are based on actual things. Apparently they offered roadside assistance because I thought I could use a little rest. Be careful, there are kinds of people out there, he said ominously before leaving. It is a bit ominously. Buy another cola so I run faster for a little bit. I thought that it was a mime or something. Wait, not approved for occupancy? No, that's my type of hotel. Wait, can I just open this door? I couldn't, okay, no, I guess like, yeah, I couldn't just do that. <laughs> the man was putting out the creepiest vibes imaginable. Man, I can't speak. Gal need a room to shack up for the night? How much is it for a room? 40 for a single. <laughs> well, pay cash only. Okay, I guess I have to pay. Felt like I was gonna check out some other options, but whatever. Room number nine, right over there. Talk about the car. I guess if I have to, $90, Tommy will take care of it next thing in the morning. Okay, good. I'll let Tommy know. And one last thing. Try not to wake the other guests. They might not take very nicely to it. 12, 11, 10, Jesus. Hey, where are you at? Your dad's calling. I don't know, man. Roadway, roadway in or something? Nice and warm inside, except there's a smell. A type of musky smell you get from old houses. Ooh. I don't know why, I just felt like something's gonna be scary. There's no mattress, bro. What? Oh, shut up. Wait, shut up. Wait, landline's dead. Wait, no, it's not. Wait, do I have to call a number? No. Oh my God, that's gonna be... Wait. No, that's gonna wake one of them up. Didn't need it. What is it? Fuck, dude, I'm getting... I'm reminded of the old... Or the first one. Too loud. I'm gonna wake somebody up. We'll just sleep in here. Oh, uh, maybe not. Do I go get my stuff now, or do I text them back? Should I retry these messages or something? Do I wake up the guests? Like I literally, I just can't, I can't sleep in my room. There's no damn mattress. Wait, can I watch this or my? Oh, what the fuck? Hey. Who are you? I'm Tommy, room service here at Roadway Inn, the finest stopover in Norwood. What were you doing in there? You know, cleaning stuff. Guy at the front desk gave me this room. <laughs> I'm gonna have to ask you to step outside while I make the room. I'll just get my stuff. Oh wait, I can hold two things at once? Damn. Jesus fuck, that just gave me some weird ass goosebumps. I like felt my whole neck just go like Phew. Not a great sound effect, but you get what I mean. It's crazy as I could have gotten everything over here if I just st stacked it all up on my skateboard and then just push it over. Oh, but then maybe that would have been too loud and like the, everyone else would have been like, hey, what the fuck? You realize you're creepy as shit? Had a word with Joe about the situation. What is wrong with these people? Mercy, mercy, mercy. But don't you worry, it's safe here. I go get your car. But also the room's phone is not working. If you need anything, 
Just ask the front desk. We've been trying to get it fixed, but we haven't been seeing enough guests lately. <laughs> but you have a good night. Thanks, Tommy. You too. Don't walk on my stuff. Okay. Hey, can I use your phone? You have a great night's sleep. It's not. All right. I know, but I was curious if I, if you if I, if you had a phone. I'll just sleep. It's whatever. Sleep thought. Oh my god, dude, that shit always terrifies me. I say always, even though it's only been a couple locations, but still. What the hell is happening to my screen? Oh god. I got goosebumps like crazy. But I can't move. Oh! Uh, holy shit. No. Call foresight, but there was something very off about that place. Is this thing just floating? Someone just come into my room? No. But wait, why is my bathroom floating? Do not want to sleep anymore? Only coffee would help me stay up. What if I stand by your blinds? Wait, where do I get coffee? I mean, I guess probably the front area only. You have a great night's sleep. All right, appreciate it. Okay, well, I guess that's not where I get coffee. Can I get coffee from in here? What about energy soda? Would that work for you? I ain't asking my fucking neighbors. I'll tell you that much, brother. Oh wait, is this a coffee machine? It's like a cappuccino. Wait, does cappuccino even have coffee in it? I don't know. We'll get... Oh my god. Bro, my controls are so fucked up. Oh my god, it's all inverted, dude. This is the best cappuccino I've ever fucking had. Hey, Dad. Oh, I uh, can't read it right now. I gotta go lay down. Uh. What's happening to me? No, but seriously, what the fuck? fuck was that dude that is not cappuccino those coffee beans went bad years ago and i just drank crack or something Three eighteen a.m bet i was sedated yeah you say that again jesus fuck. space to get up wait wait where am i at that has a phone I hate that sound. Why did I- Oh fuck dude, why did I get up and hear somebody walk to the fucking closet? Oh, why would I have to check it? Fuck! But hey, the phone's working. That's good. What the fuck? Dude, these sounds are fucking me. These sounds are fucking me. Who's there? I can't open it. Who's there? I can't do anything! Oh, I hate this. I hate this. Sleep again. Oh my god, dude. My body is- it's itchy because of all the goosebumps pinching something. I don't know. I hate this. I fucking hate this shit right now. Open up! Ah! Okay. What? I'm just opening- Ah! Oh, it's just you. Hey. Hey. Didn't I specifically tell you not to wake anyone up? I got- I- Yeah? I have complaints. What are you making all this goofy noise? I was scared, man! Whatever it is, just keep it down, miss. Alright. Is that- Why are your eyes all red? Mention the coffee machine. Are you messing with me? No. We don't have no coffee machine here? Okay, okay, here. I've had enough of you crazy goons here. For once, I thought we had a sober guest, but I guess I'm the crazy one here. Follow me. Come here, Joe. It's not gonna be there anymore, is it? Bro, it's not there anymore. Look, Joe. I swear it was just here. It was just right up here, Joe. I know, it's nothing there. What happened? You're a little bit close. Where is it now? I swear to God, it was right here. For some reason, his demeanor completely changed. Yeah, I noticed that too. I said go back now, okay? There should be some medication in your room that should offer you some relief. Check the table by the TV. What a weird place to just have that there for random guests. Please don't be somebody there. Okay. 
I'm not taking those damn pills, brother. Can that shit not be there while I'm sleeping? Like, bro, I gotta get, I gotta lay down on the other side so that shit just don't open up. It's gonna make me take the pills, isn't it? This game's forcing me to be a drug addict. What is this, perk 30? Requires water. Bro, that is so, should I use the toilet water? Oh wait, there's a sink. Forgot. ASMR. Give it a second. Sure, I'm gonna sleep real nice tonight. Should I turn on TV again? Probably not. What am I supposed to do here? Huh? Bro, ain't no way I just- Hey! Bro, they just took a fucking picture. Sleeping in my invisible tub. Fuck, that won't help. Wait, what? No. I need your help, please open the door. I've just been so goddamn tense this whole time. I mean, there's been like one actual scare. That's when Tommy the uh, I don't know. It... To this day, I find it really weird that the manager inferred not to get police involved as it would have affected Motel's reputation and let go of the situation. I believe that the town could have been home to a cult or a drug ring, possibly something even worse. Tommy arrived at the car after what felt like a year. I never went on a long road trips again. I would always take airplanes. Yeah, no, I don't... I mean, Tommy. Oh, dude, that shit was tense. Like, there wasn't, like, too many, like... Jump scares, but dude, so many moments that just gave me goddamn goosebumps. I think I sort of like that one more, except the part where it bugged. And I'm possibly going slightly deaf from how loud this damn music is in my headphones right now. But I kind of want to watch it through because I don't know if anything else happens. Okay, nothing else happened. Well, thank you guys for watching Fears to Fathom episode two. Uh, I think that was, I think I liked that one a little bit more than the first episode. The first episode was good, but that one felt like it had uh, a bit of a longer story, I guess, to it. But regardless, that was a fun one. If you guys want to see episode three, be sure to like the video and subscribe to know when I post it. Cause I, I should, I'm probably gonna be playing it. I don't know if it tells me how long it is. No, it looks like I would probably have to launch that one. But thanks for watching. Like I said, drop a like, subscribe to the channel to know when I post next, and I'll see you guys later. Peace.